this is an introduction to the cloth brush. There will be deeper tutorials coming. Selecting the object, add the modifier of subdivision surfaces. I'm going to increase it to 2. In the new version of Blender, you don't see the sign button here. Then I click apply right up here. And now it's been applied. Jumping to scope mode. And let me duplicate this object. Go back a step. Shift D, pressing the X to drag it on over. Clicking off. Moving the viewport over. Selecting this object. Now going to scope mode. This is the cloth brush. The settings for the cloth brush you can find under the tool palette right there. I'm going to increase auto smoothness a little bit. When you roll over, that outer gray area is how wide the effect will be applied to this mesh surface. I'm going to decrease the size like this. And ready? All you have to do now is click and drag the brush. Click and drag. And there's some wrinkles. You can hold down the shift key to smooth out and then click and drag to add some more back in. Then go back with the grab tool, inflate tool, other smoothing tools to reshape the cloth. You can increase and decrease the size of the brush. F key, decrease the size of the brush. To work on a particular area. Let me increase it a little too small. Hold down the shift key and drag. And that adds some detail. And then shift key and repair. And keep on working your model that way. Make it wrinkled. Shift key. Also, don't forget the grab tool. Increasing it by pressing the F key. Increase the size. And then pull out any regions that got dented in. Now let's swap out the coat, going to object level, moving this one away, and here's your new coat. Hopefully it fits in any areas where the wrinkling distorted the object, so it's colliding within there. You could use the inflate tool or just going to sculpt and just use the grab brush to pull it out a little. Let me decrease the size of the brush, F key. This way it's just localized, there we go. Pull it out here and up here. So feel free to play with the cloth brush and create some interesting looks to your clothing for your character. Something like this, you might want to use the inflate brush just to puff out the jacket right there 